So, I am recording on Akaso Brave 4 action camera. It's supposed to be a knockoff of a GoPro. This is my first ever purchase of an action camera of any sort because, quite frankly, I don't really have the lifestyle to be owning an action camera. So, um, I'm a gadget guy. I like toys, you know? So, I'm going to do a review of it. camera was the price. It was 98 bucks, 89 bucks. I, I don't remember. It's one of the two. Um, which is what? Like a third or a, a fifth? Yeah. Of, of the price that a, a GoPro is. Because those things are like three, four, five hundred dollars and stuff like that. I ain't paying that. So, um, yeah, wonderful price. Um, the other thing is that it's um, HD, shoots in 4K. Um, I don't have any um, things to watch 4K stuff on, so I'm not shooting this in 4K right now. I'm just doing 1080p. I think it only goes up to, I think it said 24 frames a second. No, wait. 4K was 24 frames a second. 1080p, I think it did 30 or 60. So I think I'm shooting in 60 right now. Um, on, it's a SanDisk 128 gig um, V10, V10 SD card. Yeah, I don't remember things. Uh, I know it's at least a V10, if not a V30. Um, so. If you guys are watching this on anything, let me know about the video, video quality. Uh, from my test, I shot a couple of little things here and there. Watched them on the TV in 1080p. Um, it looks great. Uh, a lot of the reviews out there are saying that it's no good. Um, one guy, I was asking some questions, and one guy said, don't even waste your time with it because, you know, if, if you like 1960s video quality, then, you know, it's a good camera then. And it's like... You know, maybe this guy was in, you know, a room with like one old school light bulb or something and it looked yellow and crappy. I don't know. But it's a good camera so far, man. Um, the other bonus thing to this camera, it comes with all kind of accessories. Um, it came with, um, I don't even know what it came with. It came with a, uh, a helmet mount, the curved adhesive sticky helmet mount, a flat adhesive sticky mount, um, tripod adapter, uh, all kinds of little screw together, and it's all GoPro stuff too. A waterproof case, um, a little plastic case that you like clip the phone into, that's what it's on right now. Um, just all kinds of stuff that I will like probably never use. A bunch of like little uh, Velcro wrist strap things. Um, I, I don't even know. I had to look up like what half that stuff was for. And on top of it, oh, it had a charger and two batteries also. I should put it on. Uh, on top of that, there was a little card in the package and it said, leave a review. It didn't say positive, negative. It didn't say nothing. It just said, leave a review and take a screenshot of your review and email it to such and such email, right? So I did. It also says when you email it, to make a selection and it had an accessory bundle I think an SD card and some other thing I wasn't interested in I think it was more batteries or something I don't remember I went for the accessory bundle so that's how this camera is mounted to my windshield is I got that in the mail today for free I got a chest harness so you can put the camera right here on your chest and it came with a head thing so you can put your camera up here. Um, don't know about that. Um, one of those little floaty yellow things that you put the camera on and drop it in the water, it floats, I hope. And another battery charger, a little single battery charger. The other one has a spot for two batteries. 
And uh, I got another battery charger, so that's cool. I'm going to order ba more batteries, I think, because this thing's pretty neat. Um, it, it, a bunch of stuff. Stuff that I, my brain's frying right now because I'm going to Best Buy to buy some more crap. So I'm not really thinking. Um, yeah, and I got, I got this camera on Amazon, by the way. So, you know. Um, what else can I tell you? I don't know. Oh, yeah, I know. It seems like all the accessories that they have sent me are actually for GoPros. And from what I can tell, GoPro 3. So, the stuff is kind of go, GoPro 3 sized. Um, and, and the thing that, that's getting me on it, nothing, nothing's branded GoPro. But, like, like the Acasso camera that... I'm shooting with right now that you're watching um, the corners of the actual camera itself are square and the holder the frame it's in like right now the insides rounded ever so slightly rounded so it doesn't really sit in the frame very well and, and right now I'm using this snap-in plastic thing I might as well show you the stop light. this that and it's got a, a thing here for tripod mount uh, on the other side for screwing it in tripod mount that's that fancy suction cup thing that was free and it just doesn't snap in quite so great See? yeah it doesn't it just doesn't hold that well but that's the only thing I've got any uh, qualms about is that one thing So, aside from that, I think for the money, I don't want to add a little camera. Really good value for the money. Uh, if you start comparing it to GoPros and stuff, I mean, I've seen the footage from GoPros. I've seen the footage from this. It seems pretty good in my non-professional humble opinion. Um, oh yeah, one of the other toys I should mention is the remote. Um, I crammed this into the case. Damn, I forgot to buy a battery when I said, well, oh, man. Anyway, the battery's dead right now because I left it in the case. Button smashed. Oops. But it's got a record button for uh, camera and video. So uh, while you're recording, you can just strap it on your wrist and just be like, boop. And it'll start recording. It actually says, it literally sp speaks. It says, um, you know, video recording. Video stop. That's all it says, I think. Um, oh, it's also got a wide angle uh, digital zoom, I suppose, is what it, I don't know what it is. I don't know. But it, it, you can change, electronically change the angle from like 170 degrees down to, I don't know, 90? I don't know what it is. But like right now, you're probably looking at it and you're probably seeing a good swath of this vehicle because um, I got it set to 170 right now. I kind of like it. It's got a fish eye lens kind of a feel to it. Um, but it, it catches a whole lot of what you're looking at. So uh, I'll probably be putting a whole lot more videos up uh, with content produced with this camera. Um, and I will also probably be learning video editing here in the short term future. So um, That's it.